Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Regalia of Men and Monarchs. We have 54 days until we're ready to go. Quests have already been completed. Love that. How many quests do we have to do? Um, we don't, but we have 10 Queen quests completed. I would love to double this number and just coast through the last chapter. It'd be kind of funny just to fish the rest of the time. I don't know if that's actually something we should do, but we'll see. So we need to get friend status with at least 8 people. We're friends with six right now. I was looking through. Look down here. We're, we're friends with a six. That's level three. Alice is actually ready to go to level four, it looks like, which is great. Uh, maybe not just yet, Alice. What did you get level four? Actually, I get a 25% chance to apply stun for two turns. Oh, wow. Oh, no, no, no. Fire shield. Fire shield. I thought the fire wall. Fire wall applying stun would be fan freaking tastic, but also way overpowered. Especially at cost two, that'd be pretty nuts. But the fire shield applying stuns, not bad. Could work. Could work. And Gear is the Fire Lord. She's empowered for three turns and 20% of maximum shield points. It's not bad. The fire penetration is pretty good too. All right, we get Levant up to level three. He's, oh my God, that's just embarrassing. 1% away from the next level. That's just silly. Okay, well, we can get a couple of these guys up, right? Um, So, yeah, I mean, I was kind of banking on Mary being up, but we shouldn't bank on that, right? Yeah, so let me just hit one, two, three. Four, five, six. So, and was already level two, seven, eight. There you go, Luka and Levant, maybe. Now, Hoxton is uncommon resources. Let's look and see what he has. I don't remember. So, Hoxton, my dude. I don't think we're ready to level up with him either, but let's see what he has. Hello. Oh, come on, really? Back up, double click. Hello, esteemed customer. Okay. I'm gonna shop, see what you have. So, he's on the right, right? Yeah, my inventory, Hexion's inventory, okay. Flash goggles, which is actually pretty bad. Yeah, these are pretty bad. Opponents, cheap bait. We should buy some cheap bait. Um, give me, whoops. Okay, see, th these arrows are in the wrong direction. Very weird. Um, I will buy, I don't have very much DLC either. I'll buy five cheap bait. Each one gives me, just one, huh? One extra fishing attempt. Still though, I'll buy five. And regular bait. You know what? I will buy. Ah, that's funny. Cheap bait and regular bait the same price. What the hell? It's a little weird, but okay. I don't understand it. And then I think this allows us to buy back anything that we sold him. Yeah, that's what it looks like. This is everything we sold him. Are we his only? Oh, we must be his only customers. How very sad for you. Yeah, the gold nugget there is and everything. Okay, so like the empty jewelry box, we don't need. Cost that. Um, the signal flare, old fish. Summer? Oh, that's the uh, that's resource. And the Colossus is okay, but it's mostly junk now. And it's like the second steel pubis we've actually created because I was trying to get that crafting badge. So that's not gonna happen. Hero's Blade is pretty good. But I thought Griff had something better. Yes, something better now. Remember. The Whispering Scarf. No, I should have since stomp. Right, there's nothing actually there anyway. See, this is already getting me a DLC. Which is great. And Crossbow is junky. The stuff that for one DLC is just not worth it. Online? I don't even know. 
Chuck it. Bone leggings, we have three of these. That's so crazy. What are those? Rocking char? Oh, no, that could be useful. Yeah. Yeah, these need to go away, though. 125 shield points sounds good and all. I already have something better for Alice. I already have something better for Diego. Definitely have something better for Griffith. Portable wall could be nice. Definitely have something better for Signy. He has something better. Ren has something better already. Yeah, so most of these are just, we're just getting rid of the junk. I don't know where Hoxton's getting all his DLC, but, um... Fine, so this is Griff's. I should sort by... No, can't sort by... Huh. Oh. Alright, don't worry about it. For the back horse piece. Funny, I think we bought a stratagem thing. So we thought it sounded cool, but it turns out it's actually just junk. Betty's, you know what? I'm going to keep the general's hat. Oh, 40% in each activation. I'm going to keep that around. And the dry gold, we made these too, so I don't want to sell them. Okay. And then I can adjust by weapon and see we don't have very much. Perseverance. So Griff's weapons, apparently, I like keeping around. You can only keep, he can only actually use one of them. Hero's Blade's probably the best out of these. Plus 20% damage is pretty awesome, though. Oh, because it's purple, so that's rare. Yeah, okay. Or these are only uncommon. This is unique. Which is also pretty good. Plus 15% damage, plus all the other things. What is he using instead of the Hero's Blade? Um, exit. What are you using, Griff? Oh, sorry, big characters. And... Griff. Using Eagle Brand. I'll admit that is better. Okay, never mind. We should definitely sell the other stuff to Axon then. Um, sorry, step away. Get back. Hello, esteemed customer. So at this point then, I don't think we want to do anything with him, right? Yeah, so dump Perseverance. And the Hero's Blade. And the Great Blade. Portable Wall. Oh, it's Levant's. Yeah, but he's already doing something better, so I'm going to dump it. All right. Okay, then. Do we want Haksun to be our friend if he has a whole bunch of junk that we're not even going to use and we can craft better stuff anyway? Well, you put it that way, then the answer is no. Obviously. All right. So then... Sorry, Haksun. You're going to stay at level one. Henrietta. Yeah, I don't think you're good out in the field, so I'm not even going to give you these, so never mind. Yeah, I mean, you're basically a weaker version of K. Not my favorite. Okay, Bulwark could be alright. Increased chance of finding fish and items during a fishing day. Hmm, yeah, maybe. Maybe we can get Sichi up from level 1. Gonna take a little bit of time, but we have nothing but time right now. Let's do it. We also have the elf quest we need to deal with, too. I don't know how many days that's gonna take. Sitchi's over here. We're just gonna be motor each other today. So, yes. So we'll just emote. It'll be fine. So. Moat, 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 There you go. I don't know why I needed to load a whole, load a whole screen just to show me that, but sure. What ever. Okay, I think Sitchi is, yeah, not available. All right. Um, we could try leveling up with Alice. Yeah, Alice is in the alchemist lab. We could do that. Even get her to level four. Hey, Alice. Okay, let's spend time. See if she wants to throw some fireballs around. Ugh. Not again, not now. I can't believe it. 
Haven't you seen the mail? Are you all right? No, what upset you so much? This, your sister passed it on to me with a smug smile on her face. Which, uh, oh, Gwen, of course. Who else? An official request to release a kindling into the custody of H.E.R. Canisterius of I.A. Lyceum Lambent. What? Well, what can I say? Seems Sirius has caught wind of my whereabouts. So what do we do? You tell me, you're not going to release me to him, are you? Of course not. Calm down, please. Sorry. Now I'm pissed. So frustrating. Why, why can't they just leave a gal alone? So he knows, and when he arrives... Well, you're a citizen of Escalia, yeah. He can't just waltz in and take you by force. We'll stand with you. Thanks, but he's a Shadurian, and a crazy one at that. Yeah, they get discouraged by harsh language and legal boundaries. Kindlings this, kindlings that, wah, wah, wah. Nothing ever seems to change, does it? You'll be able to persuade him somehow. He did not like that. She listens, you can't reason with a guy. The thick-headed fanatic. Now nah, worse, he's a thick-headed fanatic with a degree. You may succeed in converting your local scum-tiered nut job. This is a guy who thinks he's enlightened by his own intelligence. Well, well, one thing at a time. Let's not worry too much until it actually happens. Okay, I didn't get to boost there at all, but at least it didn't go down. That's something. Hmm, so that's gonna that's gonna come up later. But we at least have we have her leveled up now. Oops, personal bonds. Yep, there we go. If I had done a little bit better there, I probably could have gotten her up to admire level. The fire shield gaining stun is okay, I guess. Basically, it would make it so that they attack a person with fire shield on, they lose their next turn. That's pretty good. Makes me actually tempted. Let's actually put that on her. We'll swap something else out. What do we got? Um, regardless of line of sight, that's a really good one. I want to keep that. We haven't been able to play with that yet. Blazing Barrier lasting for additional turn is also pretty good. Maybe we drop, like... Drop. Drop the dodge? I'd really rather not. We can drop two of these. Um, yeah, we'll keep the... We'll keep this dodge. We'll drop these two. That'll get me to Fire Shield. So she'll be a really good buffer and damager, but unfortunately she can get hurt. Hopefully it won't be, but we'll see. Okay. That was that day done. Uh, we can get Stitchy all the way up. And we don't fit go fishing very much, but actually we're should probably good for Stitchy now, right? Yeah, yep. Ready to level up. Bulwark is interesting, but the cost of two makes that a little bit prohibitive. Alright. See what cutscene we have for this. That actually loaded really fast. Okay, so you're a persistent guy. Neat. I still don't know what the hell I should tell you. But I'm really, really not used to adoring crowds. Let's not make it any more awkward than it already is, my good sir. What about Baz and Loka? You're here, like, all the time. Yeah, they're good people. Baz is a good man. I doubt anyone else would let him roof to a bun like me. The man has a mighty large heart, almost as big as the bicep, I say. I'm grateful, of course. Now, Loka, meh, a witchy, witchy lass, but she ain't half bad. I like to play all tough and push all until I'll sit here around, but deep down, she worries. <laughs> Remember, if you ever drop dead while drinking, do it away from a nice clean floor. Or not. Anyhow, my point is, it's sort of uncommon to waltz around and talk to other people, especially when you're the boss. That's the point. You're big. You don't have to do it. Know what I mean? I'm not saying it's not a positive change mind, just a weird one. You remind me of that one kid I met during the war, fresh-faced, idealistic, kind of like you. He died in the first charge, stood no chance. Last time I saw him, they were making a shish kebab out of his intestines. That's a disturbing image, really, especially what they're doing on purpose. <coughs> That's gross. What the hell is it, Chief? My bad, my bad, little one. Fighting it glamorous business, exactly, but on the mind that there's no point in sugarcoating it. Unless we forget, and then people die. Sitchy, enough. Right, right. 
Guess we have to continue the war stories until some other time then. Because given your track record, pretty sure we'll be soon seeing each other again, right? That was a weird little... Okay, so he's the grizzled veteran who just wants to hide it all inside and never talk to anybody about it. Okay, I really want this one, though. And getting him to friend level wouldn't be bad anyway, because that kaplunk. Kaplunk? Yeah, that kaplunks. We'll go with kaplunk, because that completes one of our quests. I was trying to say complete and one at the same time, I think. I don't know. Levant. That's so silly. 1% away. Lucca is not ready yet either. I can get anybody up to level 3. I mean, Alice, I just did level 4, because what the hell. Balance at level 0. And I think he's going to stay that way. Yeah, that's only for him. Hardiness is for everybody, but I don't know if that's really all that good for cost 2. That's for him. That's for him. That's for him. That's everybody gets 250 health, but at a cost, what, three? Not very good. No, not happy with it. Okay, let's see if we can get to... Actually, maybe this guy. Yeah, we get him up. We want to get him to friend level anyway, because we can craft some fine potions. That might be better. Okay, let's spend time with him. He's over... Oh, wait, we can't. And have a heart next to his name that was, means we can't. Um, let's see, maybe Baz? Baz, sorry, Baz. Closer we up to there. Okay, we're just gonna emote each other, but that's fine. We should do Miri's quest. Do it right after this. So come over here. There you go. What can I get you? Time. So, emote, emote, emote. I don't know why we went out to the fountain, but sure. One midnight gone. Yeah, stop talking to poor old Baz there. He really doesn't like talking. Okay. Okay, now I could talk to... Nope, the alchemist is gone. Okay, let's just... Yeah, mostly today is not a good day for talking to people. So let's see if we can complete the quest elves. Or the other quest, right? We have the other quest, too. Dangerous Literature, which is the Meltdown site. Not exactly sure where that is. Or elves, which is the Drocker Grove. Well, this one's important for the chapter, right? So we got to do this one. Dangerous literature is good for getting Miri up, but we'll see. So, go back to the castle. And we can't build anything anymore, so just over here. And I will take, I think, our regular suspects. I hold the light. I have to. I really don't think there are any real options. I'd like to see who these guys are, but I think they're locked by... At this late date, I would suspect... Like, this guy's probably the wizard. Which we'd only get if we had aligned ourselves with the wizarding group. Which is Shenmue or whatever the hell they're called. The other ones, I have no idea. They might show up later. A little late now, though. Yeah, I'd be surprised. Oops, that was not what I meant to do. That again. For great, we lose life. Fire. They do love Babylon, don't they? All right. Where is this beautiful quest of ours? Here it is, down here. That's a long way away. Um. So this, yeah, these don't have skulls on them. But, oh, this one does over here. Why don't some of these have skulls on them anymore? Maybe it's level-based. Yeah, that would actually make sense, right? It's based on what your level is compared to what the level the bad guys are. Okay, no, that actually makes a great deal of sense. Some of these are just locked off. Okay, well, let's go... See, that's 
four battles, two text adventures, one camp. Four battle. Well, I mean, we can just go straight there, right? Yeah, let's just go straight. Meltdown site. Oh, wait, no. We wanted to go the elves. Elves is up here. Well, that's a lot easier. We've already done this, so let's just do this. Yeah, elves. Here we go. Trolls Day. Let's go. Inside, please. Thank you. And forth. Oh, maybe this is why we pick up another companion. I don't know. I'm guessing. This is familiar. We've seen been here before. We have arrived. Very observant, Griff. Seems pretty peaceful to me. Perhaps the tales of all the supposed shenanigans were exaggerated. Ah, I'm burning! Ah! Oh, wow. Yeah, he is. In the well, lake. here's our answer. River. Oh, he did. I heard a splash. Shall we, Griffith? Always. Human intruders. Bold move to come here after what you've done. Aren't we allied with the... Well, I guess maybe these are like wild elves. We're allies with one of the elves. Elven kingdoms, but I guess not these guys. Tell me, cowardly one, will you return our oars, or will there be blood? No, I'm lord of these lands, and wait, what are you talking about? Words! No words. Turn away, manling, or I will gut you like the pig that you are. So rude. Please, I just want to know what's going on. On my honor, I promise that House Lorne will neither harm nor disturb you. Our subjects claim that you've been harassing their livestock. All I want is some answers. Lorne? That's me, K of House Lorne. Lorne. Ha! You wear a familiar name, manling. But the Anum knows not of you. What mask lies upon thee? Huh? Amusing. Very well. Let us play. Hold on to your mask. We shall, in turn, don the masks of gracious hosts. You've come for answers, brain fever. Then answers you will get. I like brain fever as an invective. That's pretty good. I'm going to start calling people that. I think they'll catch on. They'll probably catch on. Well, maybe not. I mean, people I want to call brain fever probably wouldn't recognize it as an insult. Just saying. Follow. Okay, sure. Probably not a trap. They said they'd put on the mask of gracious hosts. I'm sure this is all just perfectly normal and not some They are here. Good. We are. I know who you are, Manling. You came to talk. So do not waste your breath on prattle. The Coterie will hear you out, as our guests. I didn't mean to offend, I just wanted to know why you were harassing the villagers. Okay, see, harassing's a not a very diplomatic way to put that. What you're doing in my lands, however, might be, you know, something they could actually talk about. The Gull! What kind of question is that? Yeah, I totally agree. Our hands are tied. And your cohorts are the force that tied them. All right, you're going to have to define cohorts for me. Please, explain. The Coterie was never intended to linger in these woods for long. Our sights were set elsewhere, far beyond the eyes of Lysos orphans. Initially, we merely set up a temporary camp to replenish supplies. Yet before we could get back on the boat, some fat, useless, nitwit subject of yours decided to steal our oars. Wait, that's it? A villager stole your oars. But why? And where are they now? The Coterie does not know. Until they are found, we are grounded. The Anam grows restless. Until now, we have kept our peace, merely raiding for food. But we tire of inaction. The tribute for insolence will be paid in blood. I like how they find pieces. We're just raiding people for food. Just, you know, randomly stealing enough to... Enough for the whole ship, I suppose? Do they only have the one rowboat? I think you'd be able to signal from shore to your boat and go, Hey, send another boat. 
or send over some ores or something, you know? You can't have the only one rowboat. Your ship's still out there? Like, defenseless with nobody on it? This is why you keep a skeleton crew on board. What kind of pissant sailors are you? Yeah, uh, well, if we seek out and return those ores to you, will you leave in peace? Hmm. Will you? Yes, that would be acceptable. After all, we owe something to the Loren name. What do you mean? A story for another time. Very well, then we shall depart. The eyes of the Coterie shall be upon you, Brain Fever. Play your role well. Uh, brain Fever? If you have to ask, don't worry about it. Okay, so how the hell do we find the ores? Must have been updated. Let's see what it says. Meet with the Unity at the town square. Okay, so now we gotta go all the way back to town. This just burns time is what this is gonna do. Alright. Not too bad. That only took a day. This might take another day, though. Alright, here we go. Alright. I've sent for you because we need to talk. Your leader told me that the elves became a nuisance suddenly and without provocation. But apparently, you haven't told me the whole truth. Provocation? Provocation. Does it actually can be pronounced provocation? That just sounds weird. Okay, anyway. What happened to their oars? Oh, that. Oars? I wasn't there. Oars? Well... It clearly didn't happen, but I vaguely remember that they were moved. Well... Uh, yeah, we kind of did. But why would you steal their stuff? Now they're unable to leave. It was self-defense. They'd attack us otherwise! We needed a sacrifice. Sacrifice? There's this rock in the woods, yeah? West of the grove, people say it's magic. And it is alive and grants wishes. And the rock wanted ores? My grandpa says it fell from the sky, it did! So we kind of give things to it and sing and dance and do stuff, you know, so that it may bless us. Yeah. What? Oh, yeah, and we maybe may have given them ores to the rock, you know, so that it would destroy them elves before they could do harm. So you stole their ores and hoped that they would go away. That's right, miss. And you haven't thought that taking their ores would make them unable to go away? Uh... Again, what? Hey, don't blame us! We did all we could! Yeah, you can't make an omelette without breaking a few eggs, you know? Flawless logic. Never mind the fact that you gave the ores to a rock. Yeah, you know, folks have been doing it for quite some time. It's always been this way, so we figured, hey, why not? And it worked! The rock conjured up monsters! But they attacked us instead, so it kind of also didn't work, no? The monsters, the elves, everyone got all pissed and huffy, and then... So wait, it is a magic rock? It just twists your, whis your wish around? I'm very confused. And then you came to us. Yep, so, are you gonna get those elves or what? You know, it would've been nice to hear the whole story, but okay. Gods, what a mess. Maz, understatement of the century. This is bat crap crazy. Honestly, I get mind blown that something as utterly stupid and nonsensical as this ever happened. All right, people, we'll handle this. Meeting adjourned. Yeah, cool. People of the Unity, roll out. So now we have to go to the rock and retrieve the What do we do ores. now? Some of the ores are even still there. What can we do? We go after the ores and after the rock. Seriously, what the hell? It must not be a regular rock. And if it actually conjured up monsters, I don't even know. I, I can't even wrap my brain around that right now. Okay, so let's go to the rock. We have to venture forth again. For great! We move now! Do I have to? I do like having like a basic group I go with now. Okay, so up there again. Yep. Site where the rock was supposedly magical where powers resides. Okay, let's go. And inside.
Okay. Well, there are monsters here. Okay. We weren't kidding about the monsters. What do we do? Attack, obviously. On my honor. This cursed rock is indeed a work of foul magic. Then we have no choice but to destroy it. Okay. Did you bring explosives? Cause. Or no, we know it would be nice, which we can't do, but it'd be nice if we could bring Winter here. She loves rocks. Maybe she could talk to the rock. We can't bring Winter with us when we're going adventuring, though. But still, that would be my idea. What? He yeah, hasn't shattered the rock into pieces with our hands? Yeah, I don't... I guess... No, you don't want to use your swords. Hammer would be okay. You'd eventually knock down with hammers. Yes. Maybe there's a better way to... Nope, he's going to go over and attack the rock. Okay, so battle time? Ah. Okay, it's totally battle time. Do we get to pick Griff for the fight, or did he just start the fight and we just finish it off with somebody else? That'd be kind of funny, too. Destroy the Godstone. Without missing, without losing a single health point. All right, let's see. Do we can do it. We can choose somebody else, but all right. Um, we should pick Alice. I think some fire here would not go amiss. And we just go pure damage, right? Yeah, do we even need shields? The rock might... And if the rock conjured up monsters before, we have to believe it can do it again. Okay, let's call up Signy. We can jump on this guy, I guess. Yeah, the trouble is not a lot of room here. Diego, I suppose. I was wondering if K or Griff. K can shield up. These guys should all have shields on anyway for their perks. So K is kind of just gives them bonus shields. But we do get a mission bonus if we manage to do that without being hurt, right? So let's go K. What the hell? All right, let's do it. Hungry cloud swag yes, yes. on the what now? Okay, so come over here and whirlwind because that does more damage. Okay, the stone has forty-five hundred health. I guess I shouldn't be too surprised out after all. This is a stone. Um, go ahead and give her shields. Not very many shields, but okay. Come on, baby. Light my fire. You are gonna put down a big ol' inferno right there. That looks good. Let it flow. Okay, the woodlings have eleven hundred health. That's not helpful. How about this? Splits? I'm about to lose control! And I think I like it. And then we will. Yeah, that'll slowly burn away at the rock. Oh, I should look Someone's at gotta draw the line. I should look to see what the rock has. Place of power. Okay, we don't know, but he has a lot of things. And of course he's large. So he can't be moved around, that's fine. Yes, yeah, so we just don't know what it can do yet. Okay. What do you need? Alright, you are going to Come over here, I guess. I know it's in front of Alice, but she can move too. And Cobra shot this guy. It's gonna sing! Okay, good. So he's already down by quite a bit. Sydney's gonna get hit. It's okay. Just hit the shields, nothing else. That's gonna hurt, though. Yep. We can totally hit him. The rock did... Oh, he called in more guys. That's not entirely surprising. We knew he could call in stuff. <laughs> they go first, though. Okay. Nice dodge. So, remember, these guys, they don't take damage unless the... Uh, Unless the bullfolk are dead first. 
that that's been changed, but I think that's the way that works. Yeah, Pixie Bond. So they're not going to die until these big guys go first. Okay, so let's empower. Inspire. Right at you! Come That'll on, make everyone baby. do more damage. Light my fire. So then... Ah. Fire shield on Sydney, maybe? Can't see her. Uh, if I go over here, can I see her? I think she's just out of range then, right? Yeah, she, K's in the way. Okay. I'm bouncing a fireball off the rock is not exactly my favorite thing in the world, but maybe that's all we can do. Okay, and maybe it will bounce. You never know. That did, did bounce, but he dodged it somehow. Ow. Yes, yes. Okay. Thing just keep doing whirlwind. That's fine. And then Yeah, enrage is not Savage Roar is not gonna do what I want. That's the wrong time for enrage. Let's get this over with. Okay. So we just hit this thing with a bunch of arrows. Okay, as much damage as we can on it. And I'm going to save that. Save the authority point for next turn. The rock does what? Called in wolves. Shit. Got to knock down this rock. We move now, yes? Okay. Does decent damage to everything in the area. Let's go. Okay, that dust almost. You came. To dust you go. It almost took him out because she actually did enough damage. It killed the other guy because he wasn't in range. And the damage we did to him hurt the bull folk, so he's almost dead. Unfortunately, we're out of blitz points, but still pretty good. Echo. All right, so if he uses anything, everything gets on cooldown. That's fine. Um, can't shoot him because she's in the way. Can't even get up to him. So I think you just chilled her up. So we can get her next time. Let's get dangerous. Okay, we'll put another blazing barrier down. Maybe. Okay, wait a minute. We can. Ow. I could put another blazing barrier down, but it's gonna, it's gonna be interfered with there, so that's actually not gonna work. But what I can do though is come over here and put a fire shield on her. Not only will that damage the bull folk when he attacks, but it will stun him too, so he can't do anything. Not that it matters, because he's dead next turn anyway. Let's get this over with. And then you go ahead and shoot this. As any damage on this rock is a good thing. Okay, Wolf comes over, but he can't do anything but howl. That only empowers him, though. Oh, shit. Pedal Dance. Forgot about Pedal Dance. It's okay, we have items. Specifically for this reason. He's gonna call another bad guy. Oh wow. Okay, more bull folk. That sucks. We move now, yes? Okay, so I can't do anything with this yet, so let me delay. <laughs> yeah, we just gotta focus we move on the rock. Now, yes? I'm not gonna do anything with you yet. Hold on. Let's go! So, with you, I want to throw an item that destroys shields. The main problem I have is that it might hit Signy. I don't know. Destroys all shields on target enemies. Only enemies, though. Oh, we need to get up a lot closer. All right. 
over this way then. It will hit. Right at you. There you go. Shields down. Nice. Back back up. We move now, yes? And destroy. <laughs> nice, nice. Okay, this thing is down to 2700. Let's uh boost up. <laughs> and pounce on it. We go there's no real good place to go, right? Yeah, let's not get out of range. Let's go like here, I guess. Good enough. 200 points of damage is more than nothing. All right, you can also explode some things, which I like to do. Yeah, go ahead and explode this. Got to whittle it down. 2200 already. That's pretty good. What do you need? But we're not going to be able to do this fight if we don't hit the rock all basically all the time. There's the target dummy there. Then run away, I guess. Oh, the wolf wasn't fooled. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. Diego might drop. Pretty close. I kind of wish he had stayed there. Didn't she have to keep on calling more bad guys? Holy smokes. On the prowl. Right, obviously whirlwind. Um oh. actually delay and then whirlwind, because I want to get Diego out of the way. Basically everyone else needs to go first. Because I want to hit the wolf. It's not gonna be a lot on the wolf, but Yeah, I want to basically move her and then yeah, so let's let's wait. Yes, yes. And wait. <laughs> and wait. <laughs> that pine cone is just destroying shields. We move now, yes? And wait. Um, empower is probably not a bad idea, so let's do it. Right at you! The more damage we can do, the better. We move now, yes? Not yet. Come on, baby. Light my fire. Hmm, can you? Diego would be burned. If I do that, that could work, but then we can't actually see it. Never mind. I come down here. And then I can put down the blazing barrier? Yes, I can. All right, go for it. No line of sight to the target? What are you... She's looking past the route, obviously. Come on. Okay, we should be focusing the, the attacks on the giant rock, too, I suppose. So let's do that. Uh, so I can put a blazing barrier here. A little silly. Yeah, let's do it. Direction in the way? What? Oh, the, the banner. Right. No, you're right. You're right. You're right. I'll line of sight to the target. Okay, then do it here. Let it blow. Two thousand. It's nice. I'm gonna keep the authority point. Yes, yes. Not yet. Let's get this over with. Okay, come in over here and poison the rock, I suppose. Incoming. Yes. Okay, it the po the rock got poisoned. I thought it for sure. Oh no, it said resist, didn't it? I did resist it. It's down like one fourth though. It's almost gone. We move now, yes? Okay, so she moves up here. And then whirlwinds. 
1300. Um... Ounce is not going to get me what I want. No, Pounce is not going to get me what I want. Okay, so save it. Wolf attacks her. Oh, she lost the turns, but she dodged. Nicely dodged, nicely dodged. I think Diego's going to drop. I don't think we can, we can really do anything about that. Yeah, yeah, he's going to drop. This guy's going to attack him too. Moved him too far north. Oh, that one actually missed. Okay. Big old whiff there. I like it. Okay, he called an exploding bugs. Okay, we just need to kill the rock. We don't need to kill these other things all around On us. The prowl. We just need to kill the rock. The so whirlwind again. Eight thirteen is so close. It's so close. We're unfortunately not going to be able to do massacre, which is too bad because that would do it. Seventy-eight is technically possible. Just wondering if I need to do this with anything else. Let's see. Or can do this with anything else? Diego might drop. Yeah, because he goes after all the wood guys, so I don't think he's going to make it. If Signy goes one more time, just thinking if anybody has any good abilities before I move on here. K can shield up Diego, maybe? Yeah, if he puts max shields on Diego, he might live. Okay, I'm willing to try it out. Let's, uh, let's not blitz then. These guys are going to hit everybody else. That sucks, but that's how it goes. Okay, that's a weird move, but all right. So many bad guys yeah. around. Okay, she's jinx. That sucks, but so it goes. Okay, can you actually get to Diego? Oh. No, it's on cooldown because we were here with jinx. God damn it. Okay, okay. Can you just shoot the damn rock then? That sucks. Okay, if he had missed, I would have questioned everything. Um, I might be able to put deterrence on Diego, but I think that will just make... I don't think it'll help. Now, since the wolf goes first, I'm going to try to put deterrence on... Yeah, there you go. Get a little bit there, and then I'm gonna blitz and throw a fireball. I'm about to lose control, and I think I like it. Okay, that's easily within range of Signy being able to destroy it. I think. <laughs> nice wolf dropped. Our shield is really good. Is okay, so they're gonna kill Diego? gonna happen just accept it he's not really dead he's just sleeping oh it missed so lucky we're gonna luck out this time too oh he didn't die he didn't die this guy's not gonna attack Diego I don't think no he was gonna go for Signy big mistake let's get this over with how did we live though I think he can do it he might even be able to do it with a quick shot, which would just be embarrassing. Oh, nope, not quite. But definitely within range. Then the rock goes. I don't want the rock to go. Kill do it. me a favor. Stand still. Kill it. Kill it with fire, tar, or whatever. Is it dead? It's dead. Uh, what was your name again? Target practice? Big bag shield. Minus 400 health. What the what? 10% fire penetration. Okay, no, we're not gonna make Levant into a bat into a damage tank. Doesn't make any damn sense. The minus four hundred health is just absurd. I realize they're trying to balance with a plus thirty five percent damage, 
That's ridiculous. Utterly ridiculous. Hey, the rock's dead. Well, young master, are you thinking what I'm thinking, Griffith? That the rock did not seem overtly evil. It was just protecting itself. Yep, exactly what I was thinking. These monsters just happened to be nesting nearby. It was, in fact, a regular rock after all. But the rock was summoning the monsters in the fight. Were you not paying attention? What on earth were we thinking? Rocks dispensing curses? <laughs> Additionally, I would like to point out that the ores are nowhere to be seen. At least, at first glance. That's a good point. Right, the ores. Sweep the surroundings! Seven days later. That'd be actually kind of hilarious. And nothing. I can't believe it. The ores are not here, Griffith. But why? Unless, perhaps the rock really is magical. Was. The keyword there is was. No, it's not. Let's not delve into that silliness. The question is, what happened to them? Or rather, how will we be able to placate the elves now? Conflict seems imminent. Just what we needed. More elven coteries to antagonize. I think we should talk to the Unity on this matter. What will you tell them? I don't know. Something? Anything? This is their business as much as ours. Let's go. This is turning into quite the epic story, which we will continue next time. So thank you for watching. This has been Regalia of Men and Monarchs. I'm PC Universe, your PC Universe 2. I'll see you guys next time.